seriously I have like eyelashes on today and it's like super weird like I'm not used to eyelashes so it is completely like I feel something in my eyes it's like so weird I don't know how people do it I see people put them on all the time but I don't know I just they kind of feel a little uncomfortable am I the only one that thinks that like it's a weird feeling or maybe I put them on wrong I'm not sure hey guys welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing a haul for you guys and I'm basically showing all the stuff that I got from the makeup show which is not a lot honestly I got like three things but I did get invited to the press preview and I got a bag of stuff so that's what I'm basically showing you guys today because I had an awesome time at the makeup show if you guys don't know what the makeup show is it's basically like a eye mats but it's only for pros like I mats only for professionals but it's open to the public and this one is only focused on the pros now in some areas like I went to the one in LA and that one was basically you have to be either a student or a professional makeup artist or doing something in the industry um, and then in other areas they have the event and they have um, open for the public so it's kind of weird I hope I wish they would bring this one open to the public maybe one day like Sunday or Friday or something like that uh, because it's an awesome event and I wish that you guys can attend it's just so much fun and if you guys are a student or pros or something you definitely should check it out because it's amazing. I have a link down below. Um, sadly, this year I went to the pro event, but I had to leave. I had some stuff planned with my family, so I couldn't stay. I wanted to stay, but like everybody was calling me like, when are you going to be done? <laughs> they were like rushing me. So I did pick up a few things, but basically I'm just going to share all the stuff that I got. I got a lot of stuff in the bag, so I definitely didn't need to buy more things. But, you know, you're surrounded by makeup, right? So you just kind of go crazy. So... Anyways, let's get started because it's an awesome bag. So this is the bag. And it is a beautiful Makeup Forever bag. Um, I love this bag. Like, I love it. I think I'm going to use it for, like, my shopping and stuff. I just really like it. Um, so I'm going to get kicking. It's completely full. Um, basically, because it has a bunch of, like, info and, like, paper in there also. So let's get to it. First thing that I see is this Color Me um, Flawless in a Flash. And it's basically a little device that applies your foundation so if you don't want to use your hand it basically mimics the process of putting your hand like putting your foundation with your hands I don't use my hands to apply my foundation but a lot of people do um, and sometimes you know it can get a little messy with your hands so I guess this will mimic um, your hands so you don't have to use them the next thing that I pulled out was this young blood um, eyeliners I believe they gave us they gave us one in gold and one in silver they look really really beautiful I honestly can't wait to try them I never tried anything by young blood but I've heard of them I know they attend eye mats also and a lot of people really like their products so excited really excited to try these out because I really like me some eyeliner and I basically wear black so kind of good that go out of my comfort zone and maybe add some gold and silver in there and then the next thing in the bag was from crown and it got a few things from them which is super nice um they have a coupon i'll have a link down below if you guys are interested in getting anything from them um so that's really nice and let's see i got an eyeliner from them and it's an ultra skinny eyeliner marker uh, i got a brush i've never tried anything from crown so super excited to try the brushes i've heard great things about them and it's a dual ended brush and then i got a what is this oh it's a tweezers so that's good i needed some tweezers so that's really cool from crown next thing in here is by smashbox actually and i have some of the photo finish primer water so excited for this because i've seen it i've seen people use it and i'm intrigued to see if it actually works and it looks literally it looks like water so hopefully it's not just water and it does something else and the next little baggie in here is boom from not from from melanie mills i've never heard of this brand but in the show, they talked about how, how like they're like they've been in the industry for a long time, and I got basically um, two radiant lip creams and like two little like um, shimmer powders. I don't know what these are for. Oh, they're illuminator loose powders, so that's cool. There's some nice highlights. I got in the color bronze and the color uh, deep gold, so they're in the for the deeper skin tones. Maybe like myself. Hopefully, they um, I can use these. And then I got two, um, again, Radiant Lip Pencils and, not pencils, but like lip gloss kind of thingies. Um, the packaging on these is absolutely stunning. I think that's the one thing that I love from this. This is so pretty. So excited to try this. Now, I'm not so excited for the purple one. I'm not a purple girl, so they just put a purple 
color in here and I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to use it or not. but Or if I'm going to throw it in the giveaways. So I'm not going to swatch these because I'm not sure if I want to keep them since I don't like lip glosses. And then I'm super excited for this because they are they give us a Suka bag. Which I've seen in the shows um, every time I go everywhere. They're always there. So supposedly a lot of makeup artists love them. And they're really nice for like travel. So excited because my makeup bag is too small. So super cool that I got a larger one so I can throw everything in there. And then the next thing in here is by Nigel's. Actually Nigel's just gave us a few of their little um like things that they sell in there like a little sharpener and it says Nigel's um some of their lashes and these are crazy lashes and this is by Moda Studio Professional Eye Makeup. They make up removal things and these are really nice because if you make a mistake you can just erase it. And the next thing in here are these um two pro finish sponges. These are by Aunt Isam how you see I'm not sure these sponges look really cool so I'm super excited and they feel like the beauty blender so I'm hoping they are because the shape of these are kind of really special and I'm super excited to try these and then my favorite thing of the whole bag like not gonna lie this bag by Kat Von D so Kat Von D threw in more of her stuff in here and she's giving us her shade and light brush which I own so this is gonna go in the giveaway um, very soon because I own that one already um, and then she gave us um, her tattoo liner which I never used but I heard everybody rave about it so excited to try that and she also gave us one of her liquid lipsticks uh, and this one is in the color if I could read it it's called Armageddon so super excited it's like a really really nice pink color and then the next thing in here which is like the thing that I wanted to buy and it's super cool because it was in the bag it was a shade and light contour uh, kit so a lot of people rave about it and I'm excited to try it because I was in a hunt for another contour kit. I didn't want to try Anastasia because I have that one already. So excited. I get to try Kat Von D's. And every Vancouver, I think, um, gave us this little makeup bag, which is nice. We always in a hunt for a makeup bag. And then NYX was there, which is exciting because, yeah, it's NYX. <laughs> I throw in a few other stuff in this bag. So I got some glitter primer. I don't have it, so this is really nice. It's going to come in handy. I got some of their Hydro Touch primer. Again, love face primer, so excited to try this one. And then I got this. This is a multitasker mix in in medium. I guess it's just a little liquid thing where you can mix a powder and mix it into like a liquid eyeliner. And I got some glitter in this beautiful blue um, color, and this is, it has no name, so who knows? It's just a blue glitter from NYX. Then this one's from Stiloth. Stilossi, Stilossi, is that how you say it? Um, I got a brush from them. This is the S1118. Actually, the brush that came in the other bag from them was really nice. So excited to try that. I got some lashes. And then they threw this huge eyeshadow. And it's like a beautiful shimmering one. It's humongous. So excited. Sephora actually threw in a brush from her Pro line. And this is the Pro Contour Highlight, which is nice because I need a highlight brush. So this is a brush. It's really nice. Actually, yeah, this is perfect for highlight, I think. It's beautiful. And then I got this palette. This is by Mayron. And this is a, another contour and highlight kit. Excited. This is in cream. Um, I don't mess with creams because they're really hard to blend. But I'm going to give this one a try because it's Mayron and I heard so many good things about it. So. Then uh, Pure um, Cosmetics threw in a brow browder. And it's basically powder for your eyebrows. But it's in this really cool, like... I will give it a try. See what's up. Just have threw in a mascara. I've been loving their like primer thing that I got. So really having some high hopes from this mascara thing. And then this is the wand for the mascara. So super excited for that. Perium Spirit threw in one of their uh, makeup remover wipes. Not makeup remover. Blush makeup remover wipe. And then I got this Kevin Kwan lip liner in the color. What are you? But it's a beautiful pencil and a beautiful, like, kind of mauve color. So excited for that. And then Senna, Senna, is that how you say it? Um, threw in one of their Lash Detail Mascara. And it's basically the mascara. It's, look at the wand. So small. And it looks perfect for, like, the bottom one. Like, the bottom lash. So Urban Decay actually threw in one of their blushes. And let me show you guys because the blush. It's like this, like, orangey tone. <laughs> it's really, really beautiful. And it looks like this. Look, it's so pretty. It's a nice springy color. Um, can't wait to try this. And then it's called 
satisfied. And last thing in this bag was this OCC Lip Tart Liquid Lipstick. And it's one of their new, like, kind of metal kind of lipsticks. Theme and it's this beautiful blue shade, which I don't know whenever I'm going to use this, but it looks like a Halloween-y kind of tutorial thing that I might do. So, really beautiful, really nice. And then now I'm going to show you the things that I actually purchased that, that nobody gave me. I bought my sale. I have in this friend's bag, and I know it looks bigger than it actually is, but the one thing that I was in the hunt for to buy was the Anastasia Glow Kit. Oh my god, I've been seeing them on order like everywhere, and I've been dying to get one, and I finally found one. I'm actually using one of her shadows. One of her shadows. One of her highlights today. I think. I don't even know. I think it was Star. I'm, I'm not even sure. I think it was this one, which is a Starburst um, color. So I have that on today, but it's so pretty. I love it. Um, um, and then I went to Makeup Forever and I picked up a concealer because I've been dying to try the concealers. I actually have it on today. Um, I make sure to try it to see if it was any good. Um, so I have this little tiny baby on today. And the last thing that I went to pick up was this RM RCMA um, no color powder and it's like the original just kind of setting powder. I've been dying to try this. Everybody raves about it so I was in the hunt for it. It's a lot of powder guys. Like, I don't think I'm ever going to use any other powder than this because it's just a lot. So excited to try this. This was only like 10 bucks. So sorry this video is so long. I am completely done with the bag. It's just really nice for them to have given me all these new products to try. Of course, I will give you my full thoughts on them eventually as I try them on and give you guys reviews and see what's good and what's not in the bag. But yeah, that's it. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to thumbs up and subscribe if you guys liked my video. And that's it. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.